Many enjoy spending their free time here at the Blue Mesa Reservoir. There is something you may want to consider before heading on into the water. And it looks a little something like this. During a typical year, you can expect to see the same people visiting the Blue Mesa Reservoir several times a month. But this year, not quite so often. Yeah. But with water levels at their lowest since 1977, it's impacted the way many are normally able to recreate. This year, I'm sure it's affected the fishing a lot more than a normal year. And now? We've had documented cases of blue-green algae being present in the reservoir back to 1975. It's creating a much bigger problem. Blue-green algae, under certain conditions, it can produce cyanotoxins. Those with the National Park Service say they found a dangerous amount of toxic algae in the Iola Basin. Certain environmental conditions, such as nutrient inputs, sunlight, and water temperatures, um, can have effects on when the blue-green algae produces cyanotoxins. And we're asking people to not swim in certain areas of the reservoir and also to be aware that dogs and other pets shouldn't be drinking or swimming in the water. If you do decide to take the risk, there are some symptoms you should watch out for. Nausea, vomiting, other digestive issues, and also some people might be affected by a rash. And the same goes for our four-legged friends. If a dog becomes sick after swimming in Blue Mesa Reservoir, we really recommend that they go to the veterinarian. Although for now, there's not much they can do about it, I guess. All that's left to do is wait. Hopefully the weather will cool down and winds will pick up here on Blue Mesa. And they're hoping that as the seasons change, the ideal situation is to get so much snow you can't walk in and in the mountains, you know. The Blue Mesa will return back to its normal state. Now each of the algae samples tested take about five days for them to get the results back. Until then, the advisory will remain in full effect. First on the Western Slope, I'm Katerina Krasafis, KREX 5 News.